Hello brave survivors and welcome to more Deep Pro Galactic Survivor gameplay. Today I want to showcase the Tinkerer because I find that not many players play this subclass is not getting much love and it can get really you can build something really broken with there is not like many option indeed and the problem once again it's the warthog because it's only firing in the move direction so you can't it's a slow start even though like you have that uh, uh i will just go for minus speed because i want to be pushing a lot warthog i will be pushing that but first i want to get just the goal to get to get the bridge cutter here the idea I, i'm going for full plasma so i can take the reload speed uh yeah the, i think yeah the the main issue with this subclass is really the the war talk uh, it just make things uh really hard to start and you will need time to get what you want and like just survive now you are just trying to really survive Till you get the weapon at the upgrade, then everything will be fine. But I will be just showing that. So, I have 36 gold and I think for the mushrooms it's kind of hard to accomplish that before getting to level 5. I will try anyway. So we have some here. me get this one so i still miss into i see two there okay i think it's yeah it's the it's the wobble great so the bridge cutter perfect <laughs> and i will get the defecator after and uh, what is the other plasma burster the grenade oh i will go for the max hp because it's squishy as well. This is another issue of this. In the engineer, uh, in general, it's not only the tinkerer. It's a squishy class. That's you need as much armor you can get and also as much uh, HP to survive. You might die just trying to get the <laughs> the build you want. Let me drop this and get the supplier already. Wait, why it drops here? Mm, we can go for the double level. What I like uh, about this subclass is like starting all your weapon level 3. It's really nice. Okay, plasma. Hmm. Open range. We don't really care about that. If I can get it to plasma, I want to be pushing it really hard. Ooh. I can definitely go for this one. We need as much. Okay. Let's go with the pickle nitra. And... We don't really need. Hmm. I can go with shocking. Potency. Ah, maybe that wasn't the good way to go. Now we'll be getting potency. <laughs> anyway. We can get the nitro just increase our damage. If you can get war talk to plasma, or you can also push it to level 18, so we will start firing from boats like front and behind it's also a good option if you cannot get plasma on it because if you get plasma you can still go for the other instead of clock just make it just um, fire more bullets i found this more useful because you don't really need like uh, it's it will bounce back anyway so you don't really that from boat behind well, it depends which situation you are. Like, if you are surrounded, yeah, indeed, you will. It would be useful to get, like, from boats. But otherwise, I believe the other just have higher value. I guess things are not going too good. <laughs> okay, let me drop this one. At least we didn't get like the the rolling elites. But the rolling elites, the issue is like no matter which, um, no matter actually what are you playing. If you get that at like first or second floor, you will just struggle a lot. You can go for the creatures here. So you have to face them to do some damage. Mm. 
We got the easiest elites. We were lucky. Those are the easiest. Yeah, definitely. Can go the armor. Already got some HP. Okay. Let's go. That's exactly what we needed. I think we go for movement speed as we have the pickled nitra. So getting more movement speed basically just gets more damage. You can allow it, like pick more nitra. Go for the damage. Let's go. Hmm. More damage. Sure. Make those explode and take the XP. Thank you. Okay, it's time to leave. Diving deeper, taking you to stage two. Oh. Okay, I can afford it. I don't see not really. What else we got? I can definitely go for the crit chance here, keep the Nitra for the damage. I, I might get something with 14, but not sure. They're rolling only for that. Now the war dog it's kinda useless when you are mining. Totally. You can see the difference now that you pick that legendary mining speed, it's just making everything easier. And also the tinkerer if you want to try to get all your open like to level 18, it's the easiest way to do it. It's going all on the tinkerer, like it's starting with 10 extra uh percent x xp and then you have all your open at level three so that save you at least i know between six to eight upgrade uh yeah just the bridge cutter for now oh come on I need Nitra first. Okay, we can go over the weapon range. Weapon range, actually. That's... I don't know how it works on the... on the bridge cutter. Like, I'll have more range between each beam. But there is no open range. Right. Nope, can't see it. Okay. So they are giving it just because it's beams, because I I don't know the cryo grenade, <laughs> I can't grenade the cryo beam and uh, sludge pan plus the flamethrower have that stats. This one I can't see it, can't see the range. Can definitely go for the plasma damage. Ah, the, the I wasn't. I was looking at the mini map, so I didn't see the magnets. Additional beam. Let's go. Oh, uh, just yeah. The burster, perfect. And with this, we are done with the submission. Ah, uh, damage very low speed burn. Definitely not. No need burn. I was looking at the second Elise and I was trying to not be the, <laughs> the roly boy. Oh, 
let me know in the comments if you are playing the Tinker and how you are playing the Tinker. I would like to see if it, it's only me who is not really playing the subclass or it's everyone's. Like everyone uh, shared this. Like that this this subclass is not getting a lot of love. But it makes sense. It's 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 hard to play it compared to other subclass. So if you like suffering, yeah, you can go for it. I mean, it's <laughs> chance now 77%. So now we would be just doing a lot of damage. And even with like two good, uh, really, I think it's the best artifact you can get. Or still sagging, so you can understand why it's not the best subclass to play. I'm starting to become really low, but we have 63 nitro. That's what 32. Uh, I'll go for the first thing. Yeah, that's it. 62 minus 62 movement speed. Go for some movement speed here. Wait, can I? Okay, that was close. Let me kill this one by facing it with the Warthog. Let's push it back as well. This is actually what is good about the Warthog, uh, even though uh, there are a lot of bad things about it, but the good thing is that when you want to finish something, you can just like face it and it will do a lot of damage. It's short range weapon, but it does some significant damage. This is how it works in general, like the short range weapon does a lot of damage. And more, the more range you have, normally the least damage you, you do or the least fire rate you have, it depends. I'm thinking of the sniper, for example. And then you have some weapons that are just broken. <laughs> they have like big range and uh, big DPS still. Uh, here we can go for some reload speed, double level. Oh, let's go. Exactly what I wanted. So now we can start pushing some. Uh, movement speed, it's it's good. Can't pick that. Uh, uh -huh. Open range, as I mentioned, I think it's not in. Yeah, it's not useful here. Should I? Okay. What I want here? Can go with this one. Another beam. Yeah, sure. Now I have what 43% movement speed, so I can pick 86 Nitra and still be at 0%. So far, we were really lucky with all the artifact that we get, plus uh, the plasma on the Warthog. Now I will, I think, just be focusing on getting upgrade on the weapons, not getting too many general upgrade unless, well, a crit chance here, sure. I will get to that 100%. We are at, I think, 83% now. Yeah, 83%. We were at 77 before this upgrade. Taking this for more damage. The money and speed increase, it's just helping a lot here. Okay, double level, let's go. Another broken one. <laughs> uh, three are good, actually. The three are good. But this one, I like the money on just overall, it increases everything. 
yeah, we'll go for that. The mocap, like now I have full HP, so it won't be any benefits. So you have like to take damage and yeah. So our bridge castle, I think it's the first that we would get to level 18. Hmm. Yeah, go for the crit chance. How much we have now? 94%. Or just missing the nitro powder. <laughs> oh, open range, not really. Here I think I would just reroll. And yeah, go for the damage. I still didn't finish actually the, the submission. So, we're still missing one somewhere. Okay, it's here. Now we can get the rolling uh, elite. He can come, we are not afraid. I like the plasma, I don't know. Oh, we have magnet there. Okay, I will get the supplier. Hmm, another reroll. Okay, we can go for that. The defector, I think uh, it's one of the weapon that I never pushed to level 18 or maybe once or twice, I can't recall. I, th I think with this, I just, yeah. Uh, I, now that we have the hoarder that can be hiding somewhere, I try all time to... Uh, actually, we already get the supplier, so we just head back to our magnet. So I tried to discover the whole map because it might be hiding somewhere. Now that the, 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 the bridge cutter will just go mad now with all. One, two, three, four, how much? Five. Go for the flat damage. And let's get this one. Now like from here, it's a walk in the park. More fire rate, more fire rate. Uh, hmm. XP gain at this like level, maybe it's not worth it. Go for the armor. Reload speed. Okay, more reload speed. I will go for luck and go for this. I can't get boats. But this is only reload speed. If it was a beam, I will go for it. So I'm not going for that. And I will go for this one here. Yeah. I will still go for slow. And last one. What I want. Yeah, reload speed here. As I'm planning to get all the weapon level 18, that's why I'm spreading the upgrade on all the weapon, not focusing only on the bridge cutter. Wait, I will just drink my tea because it might. It's cold now. <laughs> okay, it wasn't that cold, it's still kinda warm. It's green tea with mint, if you are wondering. This is my favorite tea. Every time, like, I, before I uh, start the recording, I just get my tea. Sometimes I finish before starting, but here it was too hot, so I couldn't finish it before starting the record. So I said, okay, just liquor, record and start uh, drinking that between the floor, but I forgot to drink it <laughs> in this, uh, this floor.
Oh, it's here. That's why I told you that you have like to try to discover the whole map because you might miss this guy here. And you don't want to miss it, believe me. Okay. Can go for the, the person. So, yeah. So, here you can go for boats. I believe if you don't have the plasma, you had to go for the akimbo. But here I will go for mini bullets. Such guns that contains twice as mini bullets, but they do less damage. So then I can, like, if someone is annoying me or I want to burst uh, through a group of enemies or just kill faster uh, elite or the dreadnoughts, I can just, like, face him. So I would definitely go in for this one. I mean, would have liked to get something. Yeah. Ah, uh, can go for the fire rate, it's fine. Definitely not the best uh, upgrade or artifact that we get from that hoarder, but I mean, I won't complain so far, we had a lot of luck. Uh, even like getting it, I mean, it's, it's itself. Uh, it's, uh, you are lucky to get, You are. it's not guaranteed to get that. If I'm not mistaken, it's not guaranteed. Unless sometimes maybe I miss it, it's guaranteed. Just you have to discover the whole map to get it. I never get it like more than once. Fair dive. Don't need the more cards. I finish the more cards. What I'm doing? So more nitro, more damage. So, as I told you, like I said, when I face the enemies, just shred them. Here I go just for the max HP, like every day. And also, like, the Warthog, it's really useful against the... So, yeah, exactly. That's why I picked that, so I can just face this bastard here. Or not here, because he's... But once he's done, I can just follow him and focus on him right now, like this. You can still do it like with the other, but see here you just do more damage. Just like that. Because I know he's so annoying, I can just focus him. Okay, I think, I think we are just have a lot of damage, so we won't be able to get all weapon to level 18. Try to get all the XP I can get. Oh, pick up radius, let's go. So the boat died, well, mine is about to die as well. Just died. Too bad. Can't stay longer. Now, to get all the noble level 18, you should... Oh, there is a magnet there, but it's too late. I didn't see it. Maybe it was there uh, or just pop now. I'm not sure. Definitely can't get it. And even with the magnets, I'm not sure if we would be able. Like, look, it was close even to <laughs> get out. So if I want for that magnet, sure, I will miss. So... I'm definitely going for the damage and I will still try to get some upgrade on the weapon that are still not level 18 if I can okay like this like this never try to stop some nails to it so we go for that and yeah that's it here we are last floor So let's focus on this guy. We have the knockback from the Warthog, so that's why he's kind of doing some moonwalk there. And the plasma on such beats, I think, it, yeah, it's just too good. 
just bounce back. Have a lot of stones, so just bouncing back everywhere. So we'll try to get some nitra with the damage. Not because I feel too fast now. <laughs> 50% movement speed, that's why. So yeah, as I, as I was saying, if you want to get like all level, all weapon to level 18, I already achieved this, you just focus on weapon upgrade, you don't pick a lot of general upgrade, you don't pick like movement speed or crit chance or whatever, just go weapon, weapon, weapon. But the best two weapon here that you can go for, definitely the bridge cutter and the warthog. The grenade also, does, I did a test and it does a lot of work, honestly. But I tried it not with the Tinkerer weights, I tried it I think with the Demolitionist or the Strong Arm. Not sure, but I think more the Demolitionist. Now this one it will, it will do literally nothing. Yeah, he would just, yeah, can't do much. That's why I said this is like the weakest elite ever. I think it's, yeah, lost case trying to get all the, like any weapon to level 18. The others were too open. It's a lost cause, so let's get the damage and keep the gold. We might get the pay to win just destroy that dreadnought <laughs> even though we don't really need that yeah. even our mining speed is very high 62 percent we were so lucky i won't lie but uh, yeah, I, or I don't think you need that. Definitely, it was way easier, like the dive, because of all the good stuff that we got. But uh, you can still manage to go through this harder, sure, but doable without having to get lucky as <laughs> much lucky as I was. So we'll take this already. We might get the pay to win. You never know. Okay. Ah, uh, definitely the, the mock up. Even though it will be useless for now as we are full HP. So we don't get the twins this time, just the normal one. In case we get the nitro, so. Just increase our damage, and now we can focus him. He will jump. I was just enough far from him to not reach me. Just enough. If you want to do that, it's fine. have a lot of mining speed and a lot of damage so it doesn't really matter when you are this you don't even care about what's happening around like full HP full everything they are not even getting close with the bridge cutter doing a lot of our damage and then you have your war, war talk to to burst through so this is I believe yeah the best duo open you can get So yeah, here you have it, the Tinker, even though <laughs> seems to not uh, have high value, it still can rock and get some good run. Uh, oh, I'm really surprised how much damage the Defractor did. Wasn't expecting that, like we barely upgrade this one. Okay. <laughs> 
I might uh, do another run where I focus on only the factor on the cutter to see how good they can uh, work together. But the problem was again, like the diffractor and the bridge cutter, you can't really target the enemies. But with the warthog, you can just face the enemy and because you might do more DPS, but if you are struggling and you want to burst or get out of somewhere, but you don't can really target where you want to go, yeah, that that will be a big issue. But it's still something to try because maybe with all the DPS you're doing, you will be never in that position to start with. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching and see you for the next one.